Well, Mika, welcome back to Ibrox. Uh, is it nice to be back? It's great. Um, I told the players and, and the staff that what I experienced here, it was um, incredible, the group of players that we had, but uh, the club that, uh, that it is, it's a shame that they could not experience themselves a full house today because yeah. it would have been a, a great day for them. And what about the, the performance of your team, a 2-2 draw over the 90 minutes? Yes, I think overall uh, really happy with what I've seen. Um, I think we were much better than a few days ago. You could see that. Um, I think we made it to win the game, but the game has to be won in both boxes. Mm -hmm. We weren't clinical enough in the opponents and uh, we were soft in our own one. Mm -hmm. We were saying, Mikel, that you, you look quite sharp in the forward areas mm -hmm. um, and moved the ball through the lines quick, mm -hmm. whereas Rangers were playing this sort of passing football to try and break through you, but your mm -hmm. setup was really aggressive mm -hmm. and how you spread the forwards to, to stop them passing through. That's the way we want to play. Uh, we want to be a very dominant team to be able to do that. You have to be really good in your high press. You have to be able to, to win duels when the ball is over your head and manage those second balls. We did that much better in, in periods of the game. And uh, we were able to, to take the ball into the final third in really good condition. And when that happens, we have the quality up front and people to generate the chances. But we didn't score. Uh, yeah, you Enough. Had, yeah, you had plenty of chances for sure. But Nuno Tavares making his debut today. Were you pleased with, with his input and his goal? Very pleased. He's been only with us for a few days, mm -hmm. but uh, he's settling really good. Um, and he's a player that we, we liked. That's why we're recruiting him and uh, he's got a, a big potential. And what about Rangers? How do you think they'll do this season coming into the league? Well, I'm so happy, first of all, to see <laughs> Uh, how they turn around the situation that they were in. Uh, credit to Stevie as well and the mentality that he's brought to the football club and, and the season that they had. So really tough when you analyse it, a team that does a lot of good things and so it's not a coincidence the season that they had. Do you still keep an eye on the results? Always. <laughs> Mikel, thank you for joining us. Okay, thank you All so the best much. for the thank season you. with Arsenal. Thank you. Mikel Arteta, then the Arsenal manager. Great to have him back, isn't it? Anything you boys want to, to yeah, ask? Yeah, I want him to start answering his phone to me when I text him. Oh, phone call. I, I, I'm always <laughs> a disaster with my phone. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to both of us, yeah, to both of us. They thought you changed your number. No. Well, I did change it a few times. <laughs> I will give them the new one. Mikael, uh, Mikael, Mikael. How, did it, how did you find it here? Because it's not often you probably get to speak to Rangers fans. Like when you came in as a young boy and coming into this environment, how did you find it? Or how uh, different was it to later on in your career and, and being an older player? Did probably, it help? probably was the, the most important experience that I had in my career. Uh, I was lucky, and not because they are here, the way they welcome me at the football club. I had to understand the culture, which was a bit of a shock uh, <laughs> and the in the beginning. <laughs> and the language was uh, really difficult, but uh, they made things really, really, really easy for me. Um, we had some international players at the time as well, so the first process with the language was uh, really helpful for me. And then we had an incredible team, mm -hmm. so we really enjoyed playing together, we had success and when that happens obviously the memories are really good. Are good. It's always yeah. nice to enjoy it when you're successful, Mikel. I mean, it was a fantastic year, the 2002-2003 yeah. season, that penalty here yeah. where we win the league, I mean, that must have meant a, a lot to you and you still must have fond memories of those days? Yes, I do. I, I was coming here and my missus and my parents were sitting here on that day and uh, that went to the history of the football yeah. club and uh, we had a, a really good group again and what we achieved on the day, it was extraordinary and we really enjoyed it.